and the annual Remembrance Day wreath laying ceremony was held on Sunday with the Head of State President Paula May Weeks, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, and Minister of National Security Stuart Young present. TTT News also had the opportunity to speak to a former war veteran who said every year he looks forward to the day. Remembrance Day 2020 this year saw no parade but a short wreath and commemorative ceremony. The ceremony honors troops who served in the British West Indian Regiment. Present were some foreign dignitaries who also paid tribute to the fallen nationals who fought and in some cases died for peace in World Wars I and II. The armed services fired their weapons in honor of those who lost their lives. One veteran said this day meant a lot to him. And I can see how it meant so much to the, to the, old, to the old folk, you know. Because they were the people that were around who served in the war. You know, well, I'm talking the, the Great Wars, you know. Mm. And to me, I just thought it was just respect, you know. Yeah. So every year after I retired in 2006, I attended the memorial in the UK. And in 2012, I moved here. So I made it my point to come here. The Memorial Day cenotaph is represented by the figure of a soldier armed with a rifle, standing guard, and defending a dying comrade who lies on the ground at his feet. Remembrance Day is observed annually throughout the British Commonwealth, as well as in other countries such as France and the United States of America. Charlene Lewis, TTT News. And in Tobago, there was also a wreath-laying ceremony and solemn silence as they took time off to commemorate Tobagonians who would have perished in the Great Wars. The daughter of one of the veterans who died in the war and president of the local chapter of the British Commonwealth Ex-Servicemen Veterans League, Linda Eastman, says her father, Josie Eastman, taught her about service through sacrifice. I have a passion to serve. And as growing up as a child, my father instilled in me country before self. So it made, me, it made it easy for me to serve. 